hi guys and welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to be using this wool sweetened hair wool to achieve this beautiful kinky hairstyle okay so i'm gonna go ahead to cut it into the length that i want to use and then i cut it in the length 28 inches okay so when you divide it into two sorry when you fold it into two you're gonna get 14 inches so that's the length i'm gonna be using okay so the next thing i'm gonna do is just to go ahead and pull this hair if you don't have this wool you can't find this wool anywhere please use braids extension okay so after pulling this i'm basically gonna go ahead and then detangle the hair and then comb it or brush it whatever you have if you have a comb use a comb if you have a brush use a brush i'm gonna go ahead and comb this hair thoroughly after combing the hair i'm gonna go ahead and use this broomstick so it was a broomstick i used to achieve this hairstyle so i'm gonna cut off the head and then cut off this um thin part that is very soft okay at the other edge as well i'm gonna go ahead and cut them off and then i can now start with the process keep on watching <music> okay guys so the method we are doing today is the twist and the turn method okay you twist the hair around the broomstick and you turn it twist the hair around and then turn it and i forgot to mention guys this is a new broomstick get a new bunch of broom and do your tutorial please don't go use an old broom that you've used to sweep the floor for this tutorial please get a new broomstick and get this tutorial done okay so i'm gonna keep doing the twist and the turn method on it just like you can see when i finish and then i get to the end or i finish with one part of the hair i'm gonna go ahead and use a yarn okay i'm gonna go ahead and use a yarn to secure the ends like tie it real tight so that it doesn't fall off or it doesn't loosen up okay keep on watching and enjoy your video all right my love so this is what the hair actually looks like you can see how beautifully rolled out there it is so the next part is okay so this is what i got so i did one pack a full pack of it like three rolls of the wool the next thing i'm gonna use this shea butter and add into a back head and then i'm gonna use a um, hot water and pour a little to melt it the reason is to give it moisture and shine then i'm gonna add the hair into the bucket and then go ahead and then use the hot water to pour on the hair because all of it can't fit in the bucket i'll make sure that i use the the water in the kettle to pour on every part of the hair so that the hair soaks in water you saw me turning it over i want every part of it to soak in hot water make sure it's properly soaked in hot water and then just go ahead and push it around and make sure everywhere soaks in hot water then you cannot get it out of the hot water when you are sure that everything is okay get it out of the hot water with a towel okay so after taking it out of the hot water with a towel the next thing i am going to do is to go ahead and use this styling mousse get any styling mousse that you have the reason is to retain the curls okay and to make it firm so i'm going to go ahead and apply the styling mousse on it okay make sure it gets to every part of it don't don't take anyone out of it okay so after this process 
the next process is to actually unravel the curls you don't have to wait for it to get dried before you take it out so i didn't wait for it to get dried i'm gonna go ahead and cut off the the part that we tied with the yarn so that we can open up our hair to see what we got okay keep on watching guys i'll be right back okay lovers so after taking it out this is what the curls looks like so i'm gonna go ahead and just pull it just like that pull the hair okay <laughs> oh la la look at our kinky i was amazed when i did this and it turned out so great like this looks like the real kinky like the the darling kinky look at how beautiful how beautiful tell me this is not beautiful guys so i have this old kinky out there so i'm trying to use it to compare so that you can see that i did exactly what you buy out there you buy very expensive i actually did it for less <laughs> keep on watching guys all right guys so i've pulled this much i still have some i have not pulled i still have some that are also left wrapped around the broomstick okay so this is actually one pack three so you can use like braids extension you could use like one and a half pack to achieve this hairstyle so the next part is my hair is washed and yeah moisturized yes yeah, so i'm gonna go ahead and start braiding and then the braids i did i did it with the needle and the yarn method okay and then i didn't do an in-depth tutorial because i don't want this video to be length length lengthy <laughs> yes i don't want this video very long so i have other videos where you can actually learn like an in-depth tutorial of how you can actually use a needle and a thread to cornrow your hair beautifully okay so i'm gonna go ahead and um section this hair into um the part that i'm gonna do the cornrows and i'll start with the cornrows but then i'm gonna leave the link to my other videos where you can actually do cornrows with a uh, needle and yarn beautiful cornrows with needle and yarn okay so make sure you check it out and learn something new as well so i'm gonna go ahead and cornrow okay the hair just keep on watching i'll come back where it's very important i explain to you guys and welcome to my channel if today is your first time here my name is vera Anomnachi. go ahead and smash that subscribe button and be part of this amazing family i'm sure you have learned a lot so far i am sure that you have learned a lot so far so you've got all the reasons to subscribe to like this video and leave a beautiful comment down there in the comment section below guys keep on watching and to all my babies in the house oh my god how would i have forgotten thank you all so much guys for the love thank you for your support all the time i'm so grateful and I'm, I'm sure you can tell from how i sound i'm super excited for you i'm blessed to have all of you in my life thank you so much and enjoy the rest of your video
okay guys so this is what the cornrow looks like the next process is to use this um curl moisturizer hair moisturizer okay i'm gonna divide the hair into two each of it i'm gonna divide into two okay it depends on the size you want or how you want to braid it so i'm gonna be doing the crochet hair okay you can go ahead and do single braids it's your choice you've made your kinky hair go ahead and style as desired okay so i'm going to crochet and then i'm going to use the curl la la like the the moisturizer i showed to you i'm going to use it because i don't want my hands looking dry or feeling dry okay so i'm going to go ahead and then twist this hair so that you can see the outcome you really have to see how this hair turned out to be like kinky oh my god i'm still amazed at it i also braided with the wine color the burgundy so that we can compare you and i can compare and see if i did not get it right i'm amazed like my mind is blown away keep on watching <laughs> yo guys look at the original kinky is the burgundy and the one i made is the black one tell me i didn't do justice to this hair <laughs> oh my god so guys i'm gonna go ahead and do and also do one of the twists here and then i'll go off the camera and do a lot of it then i'll also come back and show you how you can also twist without any hair moisturizer you can twist dry and you still achieve the same results because some of you will be like oh i can't find this this hair color what hair color is that where am i going to get it what moisturizer what hair cream is that where am i going to get it without the hair cream will my own be nice will it be nice absolutely your own will be just beautiful just perfect i just wanted to moisturize the hair on my hands so my hands don't feel dry so i'm gonna be showing you that you can also braid without the color but then guys look at this hair <clears throat> oh my god like look at this hulu <laughs> hey oh my god this hair is beautiful okay so guys this is a point where i have to show you how you can actually twist without using any hair cream you can just go ahead crochet or you just go ahead and twist it no skin pain no long things just twist crochet and twist you don't need any hair cream you don't need anything okay so i'm giving you different ways that you can do it so you don't get an excuse for not achieving your own okay keep on watching guys okay lovers i'm gonna use the same styling mousse to apply on it when i finished i did my makeup of the camera and then i laid my edges of the camera as well and then i applied the styling mousse and oh la la tell me what you think about this hairstyle 
is it beautiful do you love it will you try it out let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below i'm waiting to respond to your thoughts thank you so much guys for sticking with your girl up to this point i'll see you in my next video i love you bye